Woo! Nakakamiss yung autofocus nito. Ah. Okay. For today, I'm going to vlog. So, let me just put it down right there. Para maganda ang ating lighting. Um, yes, as I've said, today I'm going to vlog. At the same time, magre-review din ako ng gamit or ng microphone to be specific. Today, I'm going to use this. The Deity S-Mic 2S, no? It's a shotgun microphone. Pero bago tayo magsimula, let's roll the intro para mo bro. Hey, what's up guys? Rana din siya lang po. Maraming maraming salamat po ulit sa pagbabalik nyo dito sa channel ko. Yes, I am speaking in Tagalog. Medyo, medyo weird yun. Nagtatagalog ako, yes. And this is a review video and at the same time, a vlog na rin. No? Just to make it different, no? Sa mga review videos ko. And uh, as I've said, no? We're going to review the Deity S-Mic 2S. This was sent to me by Chen Jinfu. Maraming maraming salamat. Tinagalog si Chen, eh, no? Thank you so much, Chen Jinfu, for sending me this awesome shotgun microphone. Ang plano ko ngayon is like this, no? Uh, mag -re record ako ng isang acoustic song, no? Kasi ang request ni Chen is for me to do a guitar test using just this, no? So I'm going to record a guitar track and at the same time, dagdag ako na rin yung request niya, no? Mag -re record na rin ako ng vocals, no? And uh, ang i -re record ko for today is one of my original songs. That song will be Pagsisisi. If you haven't heard that song yet, uh, you can watch the live performance video right here. Yan. Pero bago tayo mag-record and mag-set up, let's go see first what's in the box. Inside the box, you get a hard travel case, a warranty card, the user manual, a mic holder, a windscreen or foam, and the S-Mic 2S shotgun condenser microphone. And that's pretty much it. And ngayon na alam nyo na kung ano yung mga kasama sa box nitong microphone na to. Uh, spe special mention this this case. I really love this case. Bigyan ko lang kayo ng quick uh, specs no? at features nitong uh, Deity S Mic 2S. No? Itong Deity S Mic 2S ay 6 inches long. Uh, sa mga hindi nakakaalam, no? ito yung second generation na ng S Mic. Meron na rin kasing S Mic 2 dati. This is the S version. This is a sh maybe yung S is shorter. <laughs> Yun ang ibig sabihin ng S. Kasi this is a shorter version. This is just 6 inches long. Huh? Para sure, ah. Exa exactly 6 inches. This is just 6 inches long. Huh? Yung original Deity S-Mic 2 is 9.84 inches. So, mas mahaba siya dito. Yun na lang ang isipin nyo. Basta this one is a shorter mic compared to the original one. And uh, build quality, parehas lang doon sa naunang version. No? Sobrang robust nito. Actually, this is waterproof. Pero hindi ko pa yun nasubukan. And uh, I'm not here to test that out. I'm just here to test the sound quality. Anyway, so this weighs only 85 grams. No? This is just a basic shotgun microphone. Basic with uh, professional features, of course. Dahil nga weather resistant, maganda yung quality, and uh, yeah, wala naman siya mga switches. This is a condenser microphone. So you have to power this with a phantom power. No? Hindi siya gagana kung walang phantom power yung mixer mo or yung audio interface. Maraming beses ko na siya nagamit sa mga live uh, streams ko sa aking Facebook page and dito rin sa YouTube. So uh, as I can tell, no? maganda yung uh, audio quality niya. It has a flat response. For me, yun ang naririnig ko, flat na flat yung response ng quality niya. No? So, maganda yun dahil nga flat response. Hindi masyadong colorized yung uh, kanyang uh, audio quality. This is perfect if you are doing filmmaking and I'm sure this will also perform well sa loob ng iyong uh, home recording studio. No? And uh, if you are wondering, anong kailangan para makonek siya, you need an XLR cable. Now, this is a Deity V-Mic D3 Pro. Uh, this is a video microphone. It has a Ryko shock mount. No? And the uh, S-Mic 2S is different from the Deity V-Mic D3 Pro. If gagamitin mo naman si S-Mic 2S sa filmmaking, pwede din naman. You just need an XLR cable and uh, an audio mixer no? or a field recorder like the Zoom H6 or Zoom H4N for this to be powered. No, Dahil yun, may mga 
phantom power yung mga yun. This one, it has a built-in battery. So, yun yung difference nila. This is the V-Mic D3 Pro and this is the S-Mic 2S. There. Mas maiksi. But being short doesn't mean you cannot perform well. Now that I've mentioned most of the features of the S-Mic 2S, isiset up ko na yung aking uh, guitar recording. Yeah. Siyempre, kailangan mo na mic stand, no? Para you can properly position your microphone, no? As you all know, uh, marami akong mic stand, no? Dito sa uh, Attic PH. Dahil this room is also dedicated not just for filmmaking, but also for recording uh, stuff as well. The S-Mic 2S came with this, no? May sarili siyang uh, microphone holder. This is a lot smaller compared to the bigger mic holders. So, mas maliit siya. There you go. Tucked in, and then we need an XLR cable. Now, na set up ko na itong mic, no? Si set up ko kung ano naman yung gitara ko, no? Uh, and bubuk sa ko na rin yung Logic Pro X. Wait lang. So ayan na uh, set up na yung aking uh, Logic Pro X, and uh, naka ready na rin yung aking gitara, and uh, naka tutok na rin yung aking Dieti S Mic 2S. But before I record this song. Gusto ko lang bigyan kayo ng background or tungkol saan itong kantang to. Pag si CC is one of my original songs. Nasulat, nasulat ko siya nung uh, college, uh, first year college. It's all about uh, regrets no? sa uh, mga decisions in life. Uh, specifically sa, sa mga loved ones. No? Tungkol siya sa nang iwan pero sa bandang uli siya yung nasaktan. So, there. Just to give you how I set it up. Uh, itong uh, S-Mic 2S ay nakatutok sa 12 fret ng aking acoustic guitar. Hindi siya nakatutok sa dome kasi magiging bassy siya masyado. And, uh, yun. Ganito ang gagawin natin, ano. Ire-record ko muna yung plucking version. And then, sa kantang to, meron din kasing strumming part. Ipaparinig ko sa inyo lahat ng raw sound. Uh, hindi ko lalagyan ng kahit anong effects. Compression at kung ano-ano man. Ipaparinig ko lang sa inyo yung konting parts lang ng plucking at ng strumming. If you wanna hear the whole song together with the vocals, you can skip to this part. You can skip to this part if you wanna hear the full song without the effects, even the vocals. Hindi ko lalagyan. Okay? So, there. Ang una kong i-record is yung plucking part. Okay? Wait lang, may tricycle. Okay, tapos na tayo dun sa plucking uh, part. No? Uh, Mag-record naman ako ng strum no? para, para din maiba no? at marinig nyo yung quality na itong mic na to. So, strumming time naman.
ngayon na na-record na natin yung plucking part, uh, na-record na rin natin yung strumming part, magre-record naman ako ng isa pang strumming uh, part para stereo left and right yung aking guitars. Para may mas dating. Usually, ginagawa ko yun para mas, mas makapal, mas wide. So right now, natapos na natin yung guitar tracks natin. Um, ngayon naman, uh, magre-record naman ako ng vocals. No? Itong mic pa rin na ito, yung gagamitin ko. And uh, to do that, kailangan ko yung wind foam niya. No? Hindi ako gagamit ng pop shield. I know I need to use a pop shield. Pero hindi ako gagamit nun dahil ito lang ang gagamitin ko. Just to test it out na rin no, kung okay siya. Pero of course, kailangan natin dumistansya dito sa mic na to. Kasi medyo malakas yung sagap niya, yung gain niya. Pero yan. Record ako ng vocals gamit ito. So, pa, pa, pa. di naman masyadong wild. But, ah, uh, yeah. Let's try it out. Nagintay Nagtiis Umasang ikaw ay Aalis Nakakulong Sa dungis at hanggang ngayon, wala pa rin mintis Pinipilit kong kumawala Sa pag-ibig mong kaysaya So ayan, tapos na tayo mag-record ng boses Ngayon naman, pagsasamasamahin ko na siya, ano? hindi may mix down ko na siya pero hindi ko siya lalagyan ng effects dahil uh, gusto ko marinig nyo yung raw sound coming from this mic alone no, yun lang wait lang Nagintay Nagtiis Umasang ikaw ay Aalis Nakakulong Sa dungis At hanggang ngayon Wala pa rin Pinipilit kong kumawala Sa pag-ibig mong kaysaya Hinanap ka sa kung saan Ang lahat ng ito hindi maintindihan ako Sa bandang uli Ako ang nasaktan La 
lahat ng ito ay di maintindihan ako ang nang iwan ngunit sa bandang uli ako ang nasaktan masaya ka na ba dahil ika'y di na ginagambala pa Buti ka pa dahil hanggang ngayon Mahal pa rin kita, hinanap ka sa kung saan Ang lahat ng ito'y di Okay, so now that we are done hearing the raw sound of the Daiti S Mic 2S, I will then upload the mastered version no, after this video. So you can hear the mastered version no, if ever you are planning to use the Daiti S Mic 2S for your home recording studio. Tell me how it sounds like in my comment section below. For me, my final thoughts about the S Mic 2S is it really has a flat response. Pero yun, sobrang nagustuhan ko yung tunog nito. So in conclusion, I love the S Mic 2S when it comes to uh, recording um, re guitars and uh, vocals. No? And uh, it's really good din pagdating sa live streaming. And uh, I'm pretty sure mas magiging maganda rin siya when I mount this on my camera as well. So that has been my my review and my vlog regarding the S Mic 2S. Once again, I want to thank Chen Jin Fu for uh, sending the S Mic 2S here in the attic. Uh, thank you so much, uh, Chen, for trusting me with your microphones and I really love the IT products. You know that. If you like this video, and you want to see videos, you can subscribe. Just click that. That's it, that's it, that's it, that's it, that's it. And also the bell notification so you can notify me every time I have a new video. So once again, this has been Ryan Adanshal. Thanks so much for being here and see you in the next video.